Hey guys, it's Stig here and welcome back to another GTA 5 video on my channel. Today I'm going to be bringing you guys some information regarding the next gen versions of GTA 5. Specifically, I'm going to be talking about the PlayStation 4 size of GTA 5. Now an image actually came out on the GTA forums a few days ago. I'll leave the sort of post in the description just in case any of you guys want to go and check that out. I'll also put the image on the screen. So as you guys can see this image was actually taken from the GTA 5 forums and uh, obviously it gives the user the basic information about GTA 5 telling and what things they might need uh, in order to actually run this and kind of telling you guys what you get with it, the age rating, um, updates, stuff like that who it's made by. Now one thing I'm actually specifically going to be talking about is the sort of file size of the actual game. Now if you look down, uh, probably about halfway into the actual paragraph, you guys can actually see it says 50 gigabyte minimum save size. So basically what this is, kind of uh, Rockstar or Sony are kind of saying is you guys actually need 50 gigabytes free on your PlayStation 4. Again, we don't know what it is for the, the Xbox One, but this image has been taken directly from the PlayStation 4. So obviously I'm bringing you guys this PlayStation 4 information, so it may not relate to the Xbox One, but I'm thinking because it obviously it's next gen and it's the same game, it could be a possible chance that it could be the same. But like I said, um, this is obviously Rockstar or Sony telling you guys you need 50 gigabytes to install GTA 5 for the next gen console. And obviously you look at that and you think 50 gigabytes, that is a humongous file. And uh, obviously to download that will probably take me probably about a whole day, possibly, possibly half a day, I'm not 100% sure, depending on my internet connection. Sometimes it's fast, sometimes it's not. And obviously I just wanted to bring you guys my opinion. Do I think that they, the um, sort of file size 50 gigabytes is too big for a game? And I know a lot of people have been answering this question, I've seen it around on Twitter a lot, and people are saying it's too big, what can they, uh, what they put into this to make it 50 gigabytes? Now one thing I would like to bring you guys is a few days ago I actually downloaded a beta uh, which was actually the crew for the PlayStation 4 and it actually said when I went to download the file that it was 50 gigabytes. But when I actually went to actually download the file directly it said it was only 4 gigabytes. So the thing that's making me wonder at the moment is whether those kind of Sony have actually put all their sort of games to 50 gigabytes. Maybe this is like the maximum they can put them to or anything like that. But I know a few other people where I've seen it on forums, websites, and people have also been saying that some people do, or um, Sony in particular, put their games to 50 gigabytes. But when you actually go and download the direct file, it actually comes up as 4, 8, 16, whatever it is. So it comes down a lot um, of difference to compared to what Sony say it could be. But like I said, I just wanted to bring you guys this information to let you guys know that the um, GTA 5 for the next gen for the PlayStation 4 could be 50 gigabytes and what I'd like to know is your guys thoughts on this whether you think this is a lot of 50 gigabytes is a lot and uh, whether you think you can fill up your PlayStation 4 system by actually installing this because obviously if every single game's gonna be 50 gigabytes at the moment and obviously you guys actually be able to actually fill up your PlayStation 4 and obviously they only sell PlayStation 4s with a 500 gigabyte hard drive at the moment. So I'd like to know what you guys think. Is 50 gigabytes for a game totally excessive? Or do you think this could be a chance for obviously Rockstar to bring a lot more uh, features into the next gen versions of GTA 5? And like I said, drop your comments below. Do you think this is too excessive for a game? Or do you think this is a good file size and you'll be interested to see what Rockstar have in store? I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do want to go and check out my previous videos, links to them will be in the description. Again, like I said, I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then please do not forget to give the video a like. And I'll see you guys in my next GTA 5 video on my channel. Yeah.